friends, it is me and Lana. Welcome back to my channel, The Awkward Book Nerd. For this video, I am here to talk to you about my April TBR. Um, for the month of April, I've picked out a couple of books that I would like to read. I am also taking part in the Magical Readathon this year. This is my first time taking part, so I will be doing the Owls. In case you don't know, the Magical Readathon is a month-long readathon. It's like Harry Potter themed, and it takes the idea of when uh, they have to take owls at Hogwarts, Hogwarts to uh, decide what career they're going to pursue and stuff like that. So they have to take the specific classes and then they move on to the newts after the owls and it's all that kind of stuff. And it's been pretty popular. I've seen a lot of people have fun doing it. So I decided that this year I wanted to try doing it. Um, and it's really cool because you get like a list of careers you can go for and then um, a list of the prompts that or classes that you will be taking. So the career I chose was Aurologist, which is um, the study of auras, basically. And I figured, I don't know, it kind of fit my personality and I thought, why not? <laughs> um, also had a short list of classes, which I appreciated a lot because I didn't want to overwhelm myself this month just because I'm still trying to get over my slump. But I am super excited to participate. I'm super excited for this career. The classes I have to take are astronomy, divination and history of magic um for astronomy it is night classes read the majority of this book when it's dark outside for that i chose uh kingdom of souls by rena baron i was talking to my friend carrie from carrie the book bell and we realized that we kind of wanted to read some of our backlist arcs that we've had for a while and haven't really touched and this was one of them so we decided that we wanted to buddy read this one together this month which i'm super excited about the next class i have is divination which was third eye assign numbers to your tbr and use a random number generator to pick your read so i chose uh, a book from my goodreads physical tbr shelf i had 116 books on there don't judge me and i had someone pick a number and they picked 76. so the 76th book i had on that list was teen titans raven by cammy garcia and illustrated by gabriel piccolo i have been wanting to read this for a while so i'm excited to finally get to it and i'm excited it's a graphic novel because it's not going to be too tedious for me to try and read <laughs> for my first time doing this um so yeah super excited i also really love teen titans so i love that they're gonna do these origin stories and i'm excited to collect them all the last class i have to do is history of magic which is to witch hunts a book featuring witches or wizards or both so for that one i decided to stick with the graphic novel theme and i chose to do witch um part one volume one and i'm so excited to read this i um got this from my friend laura from bookies and cookies for christmas i believe and yeah i just loved this tv show as a kid so i'm excited to finally read uh the graphic novels and see if i like them as much as i did the tv show so yeah super exciting so these are the books that i will be reading for the owls two graphic novels i think i can definitely work with this i also chose three more books that i kind of wanted to focus on too for my spring tbr so that way i can just keep going and get some books read so the first one i chose was famous in a small town by emma mills um i got this from my valentine's cupid person um for the valentine's readathon and i'm so excited to read this because i liked the first book i read by emma mills so i'm excited to read this one and see if i like it as much also i really love these covers um and i'm so excited the rest of her books are kind of getting redone in the same style so yeah I love it. The next book I want to read is That's Not What Happened by Cody Keplinger. So this book is, one. this is one of my backlist arcs. It came out in like 2018, so I definitely need to read it. Um, it's about a girl who experiences a school shooting. And so she's in the bathroom, I guess, with her best friend when her best friend dies. And um, she's trying to decide whether she should tell her side of the story or whether she should just let people believe um, the rumors that have been going around about like her best friend and what happened in the bathroom. Um, so I guess it's kind of her deciding whether like she should just tell the truth and like tell her own story or not. Um, it's kind of what I've gotten from the synopsis of the story. So I'm kind of intrigued to see how this is handled and what goes on. 
All right, and the last book I chose to read for April is Ash Princess by Laura Sebastian. So I believe the last book in this trilogy came out either this year or the end of last year, around that time period. So I figured it's probably time that I start this and I read it because I've had this for a minute. <laughs> um, I do enjoy this cover though, it's really pretty. But um, it's, from what I remember, it's like a princess who's been basically, like her kingdom got taken over and so, She's kind of been pushed out, and so she, I guess she's coming back for revenge or something like that. I don't know the full story, and I'm okay with that. I kind of just want to go in with the least amount of knowledge possible um, and see how much I like it. So, those are the books I will be reading in April. Hopefully, you enjoyed this TBR. If you've read any of these, please let me know down below and tell me if you liked them, if you didn't like them, just your thoughts in general. Um... I love hearing comments from you guys. I love seeing um, your opinions. And yeah, if you're not good at commenting, go ahead and leave me an emoji down below just to let me know you are here because I like to know that people are watching and I'm not just talking to myself, even though technically I am. <laughs> I'm stealing the idea from my friend Sylvia from Wish Fulfillment. And if you want to see more videos from me, please subscribe down below. If you want to get notified for when I post another video, please hit that bell button and you will definitely get those notifications. And if you want to follow me on any of my social medias, they are down below. Twitter is my most used one, so definitely come talk to me and we can be friends or just talk about books or animal crossing or whatever you want to talk about we can talk about um if i if i know the topic <laughs> but yeah uh you are all some in a world full of weeds